And our live team coverage continues with Alex Glade. Yeah, Tara talking about excited kids. Well, Alex is live at Wolf Street Academy in Southeast Baltimore where they watch the partial eclipse. Alex, I think you had the most excited kids in Maryland today. I, I think so, Rick. Listen, Nikki and Rick, it got darker. And it got cooler here, and the kids were absolutely amazed by this eclipse. It's something that they had never experienced, and I had the honor to take it in with them. And honestly, it made me feel like a kid again. These kids so special and so just amazed by this experience. For the first time since 2017, an eclipse passing over the United States. I was uh, like three years old when, when the last one happened, so I was like a baby. The kids at Wolf Street Academy in East Baltimore have been learning about eclipses to prepare for the rare occasion. And the moon is 400 times away from the sun, and the moon is also 400 times smaller than the sun. It perfectly, it could perfectly align. Baltimore, not on the path of totality where the full eclipse could be viewed, but close enough for kids to experience all and wonder. It looks like somebody took a bite out of a yellow cookie. I see the moon and the sun. The moon's kind of just like, hi guys, I'm here. Here and gone in moments, but memories that will last a lifetime. And that next eclipse, we got to wait 20 more years. And these kids reminded me that they will be 29 and 30 years old the next time this thing comes around. I mean, they'll be me. <laughs> they will be me. Uh, so just incredible experience this with guys. Yellow cookie. I love it. Those kids are adorable. Alex, you're a kid at heart, so you fit right <laughs> in. Good stuff. Thank you.